Today I'm sharing a simple and delicious curry powder fried fish recipe with just 5 ingredients. Start off with heating the oil. Add 750 ml of cooking oil in the wok. Switch on the heat to medium, allowing it to heat up for 8 minutes. Next, marinate the fish. I have 450 grams of fish fillet. Today, I am using Spanish mackerel or in Malaysia, ikan tinggeri. Any fish can be used as well. Sprinkle quarter teaspoon of salt on all the pieces. And spread it evenly. Turn the fish to the other side. Sprinkling another quarter teaspoon of salt. Rub and marinate as well. With 3 tablespoons of curry powder, coat the fish one by one. I am making a layer quite thick because a lot tend to be released as it cooks. Turn to the other side and repeat. Transfer the fish to another plate and put it aside. There is some balance of curry powder. Strip the curry leaves from 5 stems and drop them to the plate. Mix the curry leaves with curry powder, coating them evenly. This absorbs excess moisture from curry leaves, which reduces the oil splashes when frying. Alright, all the preparations are done. Let's check on the oil. Dip wooden cooking chopstick in the oil. If bubbles form up, it means the oil is ready for frying. Gently place the fish into the hot oil. Be careful of hot oil splashes. One by one, I am adding the fish into the hot oil. I recommend frying it in medium heat for 4 minutes or until it is fully cooked at the bottom. With a spatula, I am gently pushing the oil to the top of the fish to seal the top while it is cooking at the bottom. As my wok is very hot now, I am gently stirring the fish side to side so it does not rest on the wok and burn. Usually fish fillet can be cooked really fast. After 4 minutes, flip to the other side and cook it for 1 more minute. Add in all the curry leaves. Continue frying for about two and a half minutes or until the curry leaves are very crispy. All right, all done. The fish is cooked and the curry leaves are very crispy now. Remove the fish and curry leaves from hot oil with a strainer. Checking gently to remove excess oil. Switch off the heat. Place the fish on a cooling rack to drip off more oil. Sprinkle the curry leaves on the top and our curry powder fried fish is ready to be served. Let's eat! Wow, this is really great to eat with rice. The fish is so fresh, crispy on the outside and soft on the inside. The curry powder boosts the taste and the fragrance, while crispy curry leaves complement it so well. Thank you for watching. Please like and share if you have enjoyed the video. This is Home Cooking with Somjit. Thank you and bye-bye!